So I am back with part two of the 200 top 80s songs. So uh, from 200 to 101, I probably was familiar with maybe, maybe half of the songs or even less. And there were even some artists that I'd never even heard of before. So let's see if this list, I know a few more of the songs. And as always, please remember to leave a comment below and like the video and please subscribe. Thank you. Yep. Space Age, Space Age Love Song, A Flock of Seagulls. Of course, their biggest hit was Iran. I always, even back in uh, 1982, I really, <laughs> I really thought the uh, haircuts were a little embarrassing. Well, first artist I have not heard of for this video, Gregory Abbott, Shake You Down. I've heard of them, but not familiar with the song. Yeah, of course, I Love Rock and Roll, one of the big, probably one of the biggest hits from the 80s. Nope, nope, nope. The Waitresses, never heard of. I know what boys like. Def Leppard, they were big in the 80s. And I even bought a couple of their albums. Pour some sugar on me. <laughs> I remember the song, but uh, no, I did not buy any of their albums. Climax, Meeting in the Ladies' Room. Romeo Void, I've heard of, never seen. Like I said, you know, just going by the song title, if... I played the song, I'm like, oh yeah, I remember that. But Mission of Burma, I've heard of them. That's when I reach for my revolver. Nope, never heard of. Yep, yeah. You Spin Me Around Like a Record, very, very catchy song. Dead or Alive. Aretha Franklin, Who's Zooming Who, great song. Yep, Tainted Love. You know, once again, some songs are just so overplayed on the radio that you kind of get sick of them. But, you know, it's not the song's fault. It's still a great song. The Gap Band I've heard of, You Dropped a Bomb on Me. Yeah, Relax, that was a great song from 1984. Slick Rick, Children's Story. <laughs> the specials, they were great. Ghost Town, excellent song. New edition, Cool It Now, with uh, Bobby Brown. Yaz, I've heard of the band, but not familiar with the song. Yeah, George Michael, very talented artist. Faith is a great song. Soul to Soul, Back to Life, However Do You Want Me. Not familiar with the song. More Than This, that was a great song by Roxy Music. Yeah, never a fan, like I said, never a fan of uh, these hair metal bands. Yeah, Big Country, they were great. The Pretenders, love the Pretenders. Talk of the Town, superb song. Echo in the, yeah, I, back in the 80s, I never checked out Echo and the Bunnymen, but on my Patreon, I've had a couple of requests for them and I've always really liked what I've heard. Yeah, Blondie, of course. I think most people in the 80s loved Blondie. Inner City, never heard of. Yeah, I, I was more a fan of uh, the really early years of Van Halen, and then I kind of lost interest in them. Shriek Back, I've heard of the band. 
EPMD. I thought I would no, know more of the songs on these lists. Believe it or not, I know ACDC and the song Hell's Bells. Great song. The Weather Girls, It's Rainy Men, I remember that. <laughs> yeah, Missing You. Great song by John Waite. Private Idaho, another great song by the B-52s, although my favorite is Rock Lobster. Expose, Point of No Return. Never Heard, Waiting Room. Cameo, Word Up, that was a great dance song. In Deep, Last Night a DJ Saved My Life. Yeah, great song by Bruce Springsteen. De La Soul. I know. I don't know. I don't know the song. Another band I never really, you know, I, I probably saw two or three of their videos on uh, television on much music, but not that familiar with them. Yeah, Total Eclipse of the Heart. That was a great song. Almost like the female version of Rod Stewart. Yeah, I liked Adam and the Ants back in the day. Stand and deliver. Funky 4 plus 1, that's the joint. Pixies, that is a great song, Debaser. It's pretty heavy. Seven Year Ache, yeah, that's a good song. Yeah, once again, it's a song that, you know, you hear it so much, you kind of get tired of it, but... It's a great song, Eddie Grant. Top 50. Yeah, I've never been the biggest Metallica fan, but I respect them. And uh, Master of Puppets is a really good song. Chaka Khan, not familiar with the song though. That was huge in the 80s. Very catchy. Beastie Boys, not familiar with that song. My favorite Be uh, Beastie Boys song is probably Sabotage. Nope. Yeah, Push It, Salt and Pepper. Just Like Honey. I, I Like I said, I probably heard the song before, but I'd have to hear it again and then go, oh yeah, that song. Teenage Ride. I never got into Sonic Youth either. Shannon, Let the Music Play. Yep, U2 Bad. I loved U2 in the 80s. Yeah, Sonic Youth. Great song by Marvin Gaye. I remember buying the 45. Love the Clash. Anything by the Clash is usually excellent. Super Freak. That was a great song. Yep. Culture Club. Yeah, I love that song. Buffalo Stance by Nina Cherry. Love David Bowie. It's good. I'm at least you know the ones near near the top for the most part. I I know, except this one. <laughs> this ain't no picnic. The Minuteman. I've heard of the Minuteman, but not that song. It takes two. I remember that. It's good. Cindy Lauper, very talented artist. That was a big hit in the eighties, nineteen eighty three. Yeah. Even today, people are saying, Larry, you, you got to check out their albums. It's just, you know, with, with what happened with the band, you know, his suicide and everything. I don't, but Love Will Tear Us Apart is an excellent song. Tina Turner, once again, a song that was so overplayed on the radio, but she is a great talent. 
was never really a fan of Guns N' Roses, but Welcome to the Jungle. Uh, I like it. Love Talking Heads. This must be the place. Big Daddy Kane. Ain't no half-stepping. Never heard. Diana Ross and Coming Out. Another great talent. Yeah, I was never a fan of Depeche Mode. But I know the song. Just can't get enough. The Replacements. Another band I never got into. Planet Rock. Yeah was the Electro Hop 12-inch that totally transformed how this planet rocks. Yeah. Like I said, it's been probably 40 years since I've heard this song, but I kind of remember it. George Clinton, Atomic Dog. I remember the video for that too. Yeah. New Order, Temptation. Remember that one? That was good. Nipple to the bottle. <laughs> Grace Jones, I've heard of, of course. Yep, Spellbound. Great song. R.E.M. Hmm. Yeah, I started buying their albums probably after. Uh, I think the first one I bought was Automatic for the People, which is my favorite R.E.M. album. So I don't remember sitting still. I know you got soul. Smooth operator. Yeah. That was a great song. Run, run DMC. They were always good. Sucker MCs. Love the cure. Just like heaven. One of their many great songs. NWA. Remember that one? Nasty by Janet Jackson. Yeah. I remember these songs. The Smiths. I think overall I'm more of a fan of The Cure than The Smiths, but I did like a lot of a lot of their songs. So top 10. 10, 9. The great Kate Bush running up that hill. Love it. Hungry like a, like the wolf. Was never a big Duran Duran song fan, but uh, that is a great 80s song. The Go Go's, very catchy song. How Will I Know? Great talent, just not my kind of music. Bring the Noise, I Remember by Public Enemy. The great Michael Jackson. Billie Jean, along, that's my favorite song along with uh, Wanna Be Start, no, yeah, Wanna Be Starting Something and The Way You Make Me Feel. The Message, one of the earliest rap songs, if not the earliest. Like a Prayer, yeah, it was a good song back in the day, but I'm not really a fan. Michael Jackson's got to be number one with Thriller or Beat It. Like, weird. Oh, Prince. Yeah. Yeah, I like that song, Kiss. I don't like everything Prince has done, but I used to buy some of his albums back in the day. And I love Kiss. Yeah. Not the band Kiss. <laughs> so that's it. Let me know your thoughts on... Yeah, there's a lot of... I mean... There wasn't enough Michael Jackson in the 200 songs. There was no Sparks. And uh, yeah, I would love your thoughts on this top 280 songs. The best from the 80s, according to Rolling Stone. I think there's a few missing. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Have a great day.